it's not that Tantra is specifically about sexuality. It's more true to say that Tantra doesn't specifically leave sexuality out or doesn't address sexuality just only in a negative manner. A lot of people in the spiritual path have this issue with sexuality that it's a choice between the worldly pursuit and the otherworldly. So, you know, move immediately into the higher things, the things beyond sex. Now, okay, not that those higher things aren't there, but what Tantra says is, if all is in the end one, if the dissolution of all polarities in the end is this thing we'd call oneness or no thingness, then no part divided of that is the right one, and no one of them can be the wrong one. That what you'd call the worldly, there's just as much possibility in full awareness, full experience of that, there's just as much possibility there to attain as in the pursuit of what we'd call the otherworldly, shutting off the sexuality and trying to move into other spaces.